What is up guys? Today's diary entry is from New York. I'm actually right now packing my bags. I'm going back to Miami today. I have mixed feelings about it. I'm a little bummed. I wanted to quickly chat with you before I go this week. I had three different conversations with three different women and they all said the exact same thing verbatim. The topic for today's diary entry is accountability. But first, let me tell you guys. In the last few months, obviously so much has changed in my world, in my personal life, in my business, all of these things. And a conversation that I've been having with my close friends is as you're growing and changing and evolving, sometimes it can be hard to make a strategy. It can be hard to make a plan. It can be really overwhelming and you don't know where to start. But basically, I was back in New York this week and had these conversations with three of my different friends. We sat down at coffee, the first friend, and we were talking about how she wants to launch a business. She actually works with creators and brands to help kind of develop their strategy. And something that she said to me that is verbatim what you're going to hear throughout these other conversations was... I'm so good at doing this for other people, but when it comes to myself, I find it really hard. Next conversation was with my one of my best friends, and she's basically working on like her creative strategy, how she's like reach people and show them this product. We were having a discussion about it, and again, verbatim, she said to me, I'm really good at this, like helping other people and doing it for other people, but when it comes to myself, I find it really, really hard. Another conversation I had with my girlfriend, basically she's a YouTuber and same thing, she was talking about was posting on YouTube and again, she said the same thing. I'm really good at this and helping other people do this, but when it comes to myself, I find it really hard. This is something that I also experience, like when I'm talking to a friend about an idea or whatever it is, it doesn't obviously just have to be in the realm of social media, anything, business, how to get a job, like it could be any single thing you could think of. And again, we just can give people advice, but sometimes when it comes to ourselves, it can be really hard. And I started thinking about it. Not all of us have access to a mentor, a business coach, or a life coach, or a health coach, or whatever it is. Having the right people around you to do the right things, to inspire you, to excite you, is so, so important. Why are we not doing this with our friends? Why do we not have these conversations and have these accountability systems with our friends? Who better? Who knows us better? Who is gonna invest in us more? And if you're doing it together and you're building each other up and you're helping each other, it just makes so much sense. So anyway, I actually ended up having a call with my girlfriend this morning and I was like, let's accountability system. And it can be for anything. I don't know the statistics exactly. I'm going to put them on the screen. When you put a pen to paper and you write down a goal, you physically write the goal, much more likely to come to fruition. It's you're more likely to accomplish that goal if you write it down. But then if you have an accountability partner or somebody who can keep you on track, again, it just increases. Because the truth is, these conversations that I had just this week, conversations with boss babes, these are powerful, motivated, independent women who are like, you know what, I'm going to do this. Like, this is what I want to do. And they have big dreams and big goals. Part of that can be really scary because you feel like you're doing it alone and you're having to figure out all of these things. And it can be really discouraging, very lonely, very scary place to be. But if we're getting the right people around us, our friends who are supporting us, we can help each other keep accountable and build these goals together even keeping yourself accountable for example i had a goal that i wanted to get into really good shape so i set myself a challenge of working out every single day for 30 days i had my google calendar there and every single day i would like take it off a checklist that i could keep myself accountable what life is like it gets busy it gets out of control you get tired and then you kind of don't keep yourself accountable so the whole conversation is it's great to be doing these things and to be dreaming, but we don't always have to be doing it by ourselves. Have these conversations with your friends. I think maybe it could take you guys to a new depth of friendship. I definitely am going to be much more intentional about this and the conversations I have with my friends. And I will keep you posted. I love you. I just did a Q&A, by the way, a couple of days ago, so I'm gonna edit it and get that up to you guys very, very soon. I love you.